This video is about very special mammals, the name named mole rats. So it's uh, actually about extreme longevity and health span of so-called naked mole rats. Naked mole rats are small social rodents that live in northeastern Africa. Their colonies can have up to 300 individuals. The social structure of their colonies is in many details similar to social insects, bees, termites and ants. Only a queen and a few males are those who breed and the rest of the colony feeding and caring for the young. Naked mole rats exhibit a number of adaptations that help them thrive in the harsh low oxygen environment of their burrows. For example, naked mole rats have a large amount of hyaluronic, uh, hyaluronic acid in the extracellular matrix which helps with tissue regeneration, inflammation response, and angiogenesis. It is the, the growth of capillars in tissues. Na naked mole rats also exhibit a high reliance on fatty acids for energy production, which help uh, which helps maintain muscle mass and energy production as they age. Additionally, uh, naked, uh, naked mole rats exhibit a lack of accumulation of senescent or zombie uh, cells that can produce pro-inflammatory signal and molecules and contribute to chronic, chronic inflammation and eventual death of mammals. N uh, naked uh, mole rats are considered a proof of concept that age-related changes in physiology are avoidable and that lacks, uh, lack of the physiological deterioration with our age is possible also in other mammals, including humans. Naked mole rats rely on bacteria in their gut microbiome to convert carbohydrates from the plants they eat into short chain fatty acids and amino acids. Similar to rabbits, naked mole rats consume own feces to obtain the nutrients produced by the bacteria. The queen has to up to 4 liters a year, uh, giving birth each time to a liter of 5 to 28 pups and up to 50 or more pups a year. She feeds pups with milk for a month and later on, uh, the other members of the colony feed them own feces that are rich in amino acids, vitamins and fatty acids until they are old enough to eat dry and very mature roots and tubers that are difficult to digest. Little pups uh, beg for poop of adults to eat uh, literally chirping and scratching at uh, adults' butts. Typical individuals are 8 to 10 centimeters long and weigh 30 to, 50 to 35 grams. Queens are larger and may weigh, weigh well uh, uh, over 50 grams, while the largest ones are reaching 80 grams. According to the evolutionary theory, there is an energy trade-off between breeding and maintaining the body's tissues. Reproduction uses some of the energy needed uh, to keep the body healthy and lifespan decreases as a result of breeding. However, naked mole red uh, breeders, queens, live longer than non-breeders of the species, defying the prevailing scientific view on the connection between reproduction and aging. In aging humans, we may observe a decrease of lean mass and accumulation of body, body fat. Also, fatty acid oxidation decreases with age in humans, while production of energy by glycolysis is increasing. Total energy production is decreasing, and thus this tendency is only accelerates adipose tissue accumulation. However, in aging uh, naked mole rats, researchers observe high reliance on fatty acids for energy production. Moreover, high lipid uh, metabol metabolism is involved in the social status transition from a worker to a breeder. This observation suggests that aging is not a necessary biological process and that avoiding age-related changes may be achievable in other mammals, including humans. This is a very important conclusion. <coughs> in difference to other mammals, senescent or so-called zombie cells don't accumulate in aging and make more rats. 
zombie cells produce pro-inflammatory signal molecules, so-called SASP, senescent associated secretive phenotype. Therefore, accumulation of the zombie cells during aging leads to chronic inflammation of tissues and eventually to death of elders. Mass and number of mitochondria in muscle cells of uh, neck mole rats is increasing starting from age about 11 years in comparison with younger animals and eventually muscle cells start to resemble heart cells that are very large, uh, that they have very large mass of mitochondria. So we see here this plot that in time uh, above 11 years the number of uh, the mitochondria and uh, the number of mitochondria in cells is growing very much. In comparison with young uh, animals, it is growing three times, approximately three times. The, uh, the naked mole rats represent a unique model for delaying uh, immunosenescence with no simus involution observed up to 11 years of age. This is in contrast to mice that show continuous shrinkage of the simus with age. The markers of the useful simus function decrease uh, with age in mice, but maintained in, na in naked mole rats. The result of the study suggests that, new, uh, that naked uh, mole rats does not experience uh, pathological changes in the mitochondria apparatus until at least 11 years of age. However, naked mole rats are not immortal and will eventually show frailty, frailty uh, in older age, albeit delayed comparison with uh, humans and mice. The naked mole rats are well adapted to the limited avail availability of oxygen, so so-called hypoxia within the tunnels of its typical habitat. Hypoxia results in a decreased ATP synthesis, increased production of reactive oxygen species, and slowing down the activity of the cellular antioxidant system. Altogether, it leads to oxidative stress and eventually to apoptosis, so it is death of the senescent and cancer cells as erectin, erectin or erective oxygen species cause damage of DNA cell membranes and organelles. Indeed, hyperactive uh, zombie cells and cancer cells in the con condition of hypoxia produce more reactive oxygen species than healthy cells and get selectively destroyed in the senescent-induced cell death. Here we schematically see that hypoxia leads to re uh, generation of reactive oxygen species and then the oxidative stress it leads to apoptosis. Naked mole rats have extracellular matrix with high amount of long chain molecules uh, called uh, hyaluronic uh, acid. Hyaluronic acid is also a major component of skin where it is involved in the repairing tissue. Hyaluronic acid has a key role in tissue regeneration, inflammation response, and, uh, and uh, angiogenesis, so it is uh, growth of capillaries, which are phases of wound repair. Naked mole rats have a unique uh, skin characteristic compared to other mammals. Their skin is highly elastic and has a rubbery structure, rubbery texture. This helps uh, the animals move and scream, uh, squirm in tight tunnels without getting injured. The skin elasticity also provides a certain level of protection from cuts and scrapes uh, that may occur in the underground habitat. So the following study uh, found that uh, naked mole rats maintain their body composition and bones mineral density throughout their lifespan which is much longer than uh, similar sized mice. In contrast, mice uh, show a rapid decline in body fat content and bone mineral uh, density uh, with age. The study also found that uh, naked mole rats maintain uh, cardia uh, cardiac uh, function and reserve capacity as they age, while mice experience age-dependent decline in normalized cardiac output and an increase in cardiac cardiac hypertrophy and diastolic uh, dysfunction. Furthermore, naked mole rats maintaining, are maintaining bone mineral, dense, uh, bone mineral 
content and density and could produce uh, it could reduce the risk of bone fractures in the elderly. Naked mole rats produce, as I said, a very high molecular mass hyaluronic uh, uh, acid, much larger molecular weight than hyaluronic acid in other mammalian species. Molecular weight, uh, which is uh, about 2.5 mega darcy of hyaluronic acid uh, in serum and almost all tissues was tested in this publication. Hyaluronic, hyaluronic acid provides an open hydrated matrix that facilitates cell migration. Therefore, high elasticity of the extracellular matrix can be a crucial factor for the immune system efficiency in the uh, naked mole rats. So, in conclusion, I may speculate that exceptional longevity of uh, naked mole rats can be explained by higher mass of mitochondria, higher reliance on fatty acids for energy production, elimination of senescent cells in condition of hypoxia, and high mobility of their immune cells. So, in this video, I expressed my personal opinion. Please mind that I don't provide health consulting. Therefore, a visitor to my channel is advised to discuss the content of this video with his or her personal physician and only act upon the advice of the professional medical experts. Thank you for your time to watch the video. Please comment, subscribe, like, ask questions and share information. Have a wonderful day.